A reading from the devotional, Walking in Grace. Jesus Reveals Himself. A testimony by Carol Knapp. Your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. Psalm 119, 105. One of my favorite Bible stories happens shortly after Jesus' resurrection. Two of Jesus' followers are trekking the seven miles to the village of Emmaus, trying to make sense of the recent events in Jerusalem. Unrecognized by them, Jesus approaches as a fellow traveler and joins their discussion. When they explain to him their confusion at all that has happened, Jesus immediately opens the scriptures to them about all the things concerning himself. Going clear back to Moses, Luke 24:27. It is not until they reach Emmaus and invite Jesus to stay over with them that they know who he is when he blesses and breaks the bread in their evening meal. Just as astonishing, he then vanishes. The two men are so excited to see for themselves that Jesus has really risen. They turn around and make the return trip to Jerusalem that same night, eager to tell the others. They say to each other, were not our hearts burning within us while he was speaking to us on the road? Luke 24, 32. I love a walk on a gravel country road. I often imagine that journey to Emmaus and picture Jesus traveling companionably beside me, bringing his words to life. When my daughter-in-law and I had a misunderstanding, it was on our walk that Jesus urged me to show compassion, to go to her and make things right. My heart, too, burned within me as he opened the way for reconciliation. There are no words like his words. Life-speaking Savior, Walk with me, encourage me, teach me. Amen. Thy word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto To my feet and a light unto my bed. When I feel afraid, think I've lost my way, still you're there right beside me. Nothing will I fear as long as you are near. Please be near me to the Be my guide, and hold me to your side, and I.